Shut up, right? That is so crazy. I said, pull up. That's the bus stop. <laughs> it's like shelves and comfy chairs and stuff. What's this? Right, What's going right. on here? What's going on? Yeah, we decided to set up a library here for the day. So we have coffee and we have lots of books and everything for free. We live in the neighborhood. We wanted really? to we thought this corner was kind of dead and maybe bring some colors out, bring yeah, some knowledge cool. to the streets and give back a little bit. Yeah, this is cool. Keeping it low budget is part of the idea. We both teamed up with uh, the People's Library and they donated all the books. And we got recycled furniture, painted it up, and the, the coffee's donated by a, a local cafe, and so we just got it together for May Day. Wow, man, just, uh, congratulations, I like this. I really am impressed with it. People are really excited to see us here with brightly colored furniture and giving away things for free. Yeah, so easily removable. <laughs> yeah, thank you, okay. sure. Thank you again. Uh, <laughs> uh, thank you very much, thank you. These are my two selections. <laughs> Thank you guys for coming. I got um, Black Life in Corporative America and Black Power War. I just want to know a little bit more and teach my nieces and nephews. You know, they got to know where they come from first. Because they lost out here. They don't know where they're coming from. So I agree with this. This is us. I like this. This is great, you know. I'm trying to keep that, that tradition alive with books. Call it direct action design. Totally inspired by by Occupy actions, direct action, getting in the street, and engaging the community, and seeing what type of feedback they can give. Well, I tell you what, I want to pitch in, right? Yeah. Right. Give me two seconds. I want to run and grab something so you can also yes. offer the people. Sure. That's not Thank fine. you. All right, hold Appreciate on. it. Now they can oh, sit down and have a bottle of water. That's yes. right. This is wonderful. Thank you. I hope whatever you, you so guys much. doing is super contagious. Actually, Margaret is an unemployed uh, librarian, so this is uh, this is a direct response to what's happening. Uh, to education. Libraries are just closing down more and schools are being, being packed with students uh, and less teachers. So uh, this is a good way to, to get knowledge on the streets. If we want libraries to stay open, if we don't want our doors to close, if we don't want librarians and teachers um, to get fired, um, you know, we, we have to stand up. We have to do something about it. The one last power we have is uh, people on the street. So we uh, we need to really harness that and and bring neighborhoods together again because uh, that's that's when things can start happen happening. We can't wait around for for officials and um, politicians to to do something for us. We have to do it ourselves and uh, and knowing more, having more education uh, helps. It's hot. I will tell everybody about it. So it's still gonna be here. You know, so tell them what you can find. I mean, mm, they still got some more interesting books, but I'm just going to take two. You know, I really want to come back. Wow. Because they can't get enough of reading now. You got to educate yourself first before you do anybody else. So I'm doing myself too. Look for, uh, look for dead spaces in your community. That's what we target.